guys, welcome to the Angeles Forest. Uh, you might recognize this dude right here. If not, this is Cody, and yep. thank Doc you so much for bringing out your Huracan Spider. Also Four, known three as, days old. Also known as DocDem3 on YouTube. Maybe yeah. you watch his videos, and I, I'm, I'm so happy you came yeah. up here. Thanks, man. I, I think we should. St I should start. I've been so like isolationist. I feel like I should start doing things with other YouTube people. And you seem like a really smart, well-spoken dude. And so, tell me about your 397-mile <laughs> Huracan Spider. Yes. Yeah, so this is a 2017 model. I have a 2014, uh, 2015 Red Huracan Coupe. Love that car. I have also the um, Aventador Roadster, the anniversary. Look at you. Verde, Verde Ithaca. That Love YouTube that car. YouTube money, right? It's YouTube money, yeah. <laughs> Pays for it all. But there's nothing like the open, top down. The top down. Top down. And um, I test drove this uh, a few months ago, and I'm like, I love the coupe, but you gotta, you gotta oh, go yeah. topless. I man. know. I'm with you. I'm with and us short-haired folk. <laughs> we have no downsides, right? That's exactly let's, right. Let's, let's have a little it. go. You, you're from uh, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Yeah. So you're out here for Pebble and. our roads so far you know what I would kill to have these roads. pretty spectacular yeah, huh? seriously I mean every all you know first of all the the curves just everything the turns but just the quality of the roads we are good time unbelievable yeah. absolutely so there's gonna be some wind so we got to speak up a bit all right sounds good but or, or not because <laughs> oh yes I know this road really well, yeah, okay? yeah. and I'm not going to cut or anything like that. Listen, I rarely get to sit in this seat, so for me, this is a joy ride. So, so go for it. Immediately, as a tall person, I am appreciative of this. In Huracan Coupe, I got to be like this, yeah. right? And it hurts. Up here, I have to. I'm looking a little bit at this, but no, it's all good. So 610 horse, all wheel drive, dual clutch, all the good toys. What uh, what options do you have on here? The blue is spectacular. Yeah. So the color is Blue Mamans, which is one of the launch colors. One of the first cars, actually, customer cars to deliver with this color. I also um, did the sports exhaust, um, the branding package. Basically, this car is fully optioned. Everything. As you see here, we also did the uh, sport seats. Yeah, yes. these are a full carbon bucket. Full carbon bucket. And honestly, if you're Cody's size, they're probably perfect. For me, they're a little tight down around the bum. But that, as many people would say, that's my fault, not the cars. <laughs> All right, well, you got sport exhaust, so let's see how it sounds. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Just got out of that hyper fast 12C, which has crazy power. But this gearbox, the dual clutch, oh, it's smoother and it's faster. That's the thing I noticed when comparing this to the Aventador. The Aventador is is crazy. Just, yeah. Just driving it. That's a the gearbox. Yeah. The gearbox in this is freaking unbelievable. The other thing is, I want to hear what your thoughts on this. Are. I have option the Lamborghini dynamic steering on this thing which is adaptive ratio exactly so in fact it's interesting because in Corsa it actually takes one cog out of the column oh come so on so it's more it's more direct and All I was right. like I actually like what, what is that oh hang on oh yeah it's very very linear yeah. You know, the, the, the turbo motors, they give you that right now shove. Yeah. You gotta worry about it a little bit. You don't want it to get away from you. This, it's like directly on that pedal, you know? So yeah. we'll go up the hill in sport and down the hill in Corsa, Corsa and see if the steering is different. Yeah. Oh, man. You know, the spider, man, the spider is where it's at. Yeah. Like I said, I love the coupe. I drove it once, the Spider once, and I was hooked. I'm like, I have to have this. Well, I prefer the Gallardos as Spiders as well. Yeah. God, Lambo has come such a long 
one way. This is such a spectacular car. And I recently had a go in the new R8, yeah. which is uh, a little a little cushier for every day. Um, I actually thought certain aspects of the R8 were a little weird, namely the electronics and how you interact with the nav and yeah. stuff. Yeah. This seems to be so far kind of the same, but this L LCD gauge cluster is really, really cool. The steering, it's the best it's ever been in the Lambo, oh, isn't yeah. it? <laughs> I love the power. And these cars, I use the word a lot, but these cars, it's very fluid now, yeah. you know? Yeah. The early Gallardos, they would slam you. Yeah. The other thing, too, even just the brakes on this, too. Two Standard carbon ceramics now, yep. right? Yeah. Man, these oh, are what freaking a beautiful car. Awesome roads, too. I wish I had this every day. We're very spoiled. Oh, wow. See what my everyday commute looks like. It's, it's five miles an hour. Oh, this man. is like a treat, you know. Yeah. Us. Wow, the ride quality is so good too. It's not too stiff. Yeah. Do you daily your Lambos, your everyday I, cars? I don't, but I don't believe in garage queens. So everybody on the channel knows that I drive my cars. So every chance I get to take it out, oh man. Fantastic. That is freaking awesome. The turn in is like really, really sharp. Love the way it loads. Yes. You can feel as it yes. loads up that outside corner. Very, very nice. The damping is great. So this has the uh, Lamborghini, the Magneto ride suspension. Right, right. Which I think really does, it gives you a lot more confidence. The car is just. Well, what's happening is you see these little. Yeah. These little bits of tarmac that are chunked out, yeah. I can feel them, but then the big bumps, yeah. it's really, really good and smooth over it. Oh. It's weird to think of a 600 horsepower car as a momentum car, yeah. but the cornering speeds are so good that you can just carry it. Yeah. You know, one of the things that I fell in love with this car the first time was the coupe. Hang that on. It's like uh, these driveways and U-turns oh, yeah. and stuff are just no problem. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, Pennsylvania, we don't have the best roads. Yeah, you got to drive around with the nose up all the time. Seriously. Let's go down. Yeah, okay, cool. All right, so let's go to Corsa now. Oh, yeah. Oh, let's, see yeah. How the, let's see how the steering uh, Let's see how the steering changes. You're instantly going to feel it. Whoa, okay, heavy, right? right there. Yep. You can... It does change the yep. ratio. They engineer a little more kick, kick. into the gearbox. Oh, oh yeah. wow, the steering's way, way heavier. heavier. Yeah. yeah. I drive in Corsa. Okay, we found the correct <laughs> mode. Wow, it's Feel so it. much quicker. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I drive in Corsa all the time. That's the way to drive this car. I completely understand. Can you adjust the suspension independent of the drive No, train? I think it, they tie it to the anime. So it gets a little stiffer too, right? Yeah. Of course, so yeah. Yep. What a beautiful machine this is. They've come such a long way. Yeah. 
different. It's uniquely characteristic that it's a Lamborghini. Yeah, oh yeah. Big giant paddle shifters to get out of. What the hell were those things? Yeah, oh, the tiny ones? Yeah. Uh, oh, it didn't occur to me. These are big. These are giant Giants. biggies, yeah. Doesn't matter where you are, you can grab it. Well, they've really committed to the stalks on the wheel. Yeah. As opposed to the, uh, or the stalks on the column, oh, excuse me. As opposed to the wheel, yeah. I can't, I used to prefer the stalks on the column. Then I switched to preferring stock or paddles on the wheel. I'm not really sure now. Yeah. I'm, I'm more open to whatever option. The kind of speed that you can maintain in this car effortlessly yeah. is re pretty ridiculous. And we've caught up to this guy. We're almost at the very end though. Okay. So tell me about, about YouTube. I, I've seen a couple of your videos. Yeah, I haven't seen a lot, but I don't watch a lot. Of <laughs> Sorry, but you're you're like you're OG. Yeah, yeah. 2000, 2006 was my first YouTube video. How many have you done so far? Oh, gee, I have a few hundred. I probably 800. So that's a bunch. Yeah, yeah, yeah you've been working. Oh yeah, um, and I do. Yeah, you know, it's all sorts of things. It's not just about Lambo. I love cars, so you'll see lots of different things on there. I do some motivational videos, some reaction, I do some reviews, um, but I'm all about driving. I love driving my cars and um, featuring other YouTubers and stuff. So it's it's Dr. M3, D-O-C-T-A-M3 uh, on YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, you know, every single social media. I don't have Snapchat. Do you do a, do you do a podcast? You should, I, I feel like don't. You should do a podcast. You're so well-spoken. You should I do a it. podcast. I mean, it, I, you, actually, I should talk to you more about this. Our Maybe podcast right. does well. Really? Yeah. yeah. It's fun. If you I don't know about our... We do a podcast. You know that, right? <laughs> Smoking Tire Podcast, we do that. Um, yeah, you should do a podcast. It's easy. It doesn't doesn't require a lot of uh, equipment or yeah. anything like that. I'll, I'll get some tips from you guys. But yeah, we try to you know bring people uh, involved in, in, in the car community general it's not just exotic cars um, but well but oh, come on you know what brings the numbers oh, well, well this is true this is, this is true wait what am I? oh I forgot this thing has the motorcycle blinker on it yeah it's got it's got you know Ferrari does the two thumb yeah this one has like a straight Single. up motorcycle yep. blinker well Cody I can't thank you enough for allowing me to uh, cross the 400 mile <laughs> mark in your vehicle it's um, it's a beautiful color. It's beautifully optioned. You clearly know your Lambos, uh, and, and you uh, you're the kind of guy we want to be, man. Thanks, love man. It. I appreciate Thank it. Thank you so much Thanks for again. coming out. Have a great time at Pebble. Oh, thanks. You're sir. gonna love it. It's, gonna be, it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be awesome. Mike so if you're up at Pebble, well, this video will be after. After Pebble. that, but, but you'll if see you saw around. this car at Pebble, <laughs> it was Cody. Thanks right, for thanks, watching. Man. See you guys next time. All right, take care, guys.